Welcome to DVR 3D. If you are new to Blender this Tesla car creation complete crash course was designed for you, together we are gonna go step by step, how to create this, that you see right here now, so without any further delay let's get started. First things first, open a new file. Then press A, select everything, then press X, to delete. Now we are going to write orthographic by pressing numpad 3 or hit tilde or key. Which is right below our escape key, then we are going to add a blueprint. So press shift A, then go to image and add in a reference image into the file. Then drag drop it inside of Blender and that will drop the image. By the way, you can find that same blueprint image link in the description below. Next we are going to object properties and set location x axis minus 100 meter like this. At this time, we are going to object data properties and set side, both to front. Then enable opacity 0.5 and also disable perspective. So when we disable perspective we don't show the blueprint in the perspective view. But only show the orthographic view. Next we are going to add a top blueprint. So press numpad 7, or hit tilde or key and go to the top orthographic. Then we are going to object properties and set location Z axis 100 meter, rotation Z axis minus 90 degree like this. Again same thing, go to the object data properties and set side both to front. Then enable opacity 0.5 and also disable perspective. Now we are going to front orthographic by pressing numpad 1, or hit tilde or key. Then we are going to add a front blueprint. Next we are going to object properties and set location Y axis minus 100 meter like this. At this moment, we are going to do the same thing again, go to the object data properties and set side both to front. Then enable opacity 0.5 and also disable perspective. Now we are going to back orthographic. So go ahead press Ctrl numpad 1, or hit tilde or key. Then we are going to add a back blueprint. Next we are going to object properties and set location Y axis 100 meter, rotation Z axis 0 degree like this. Again go to the object data properties and set side, both to back. Then enable opacity 0.5 and also disable perspective. Now we are going to outliner add a new collection named Blueprint. Then we will drag and drop the image like this. Also rename this. At this time go to Filter on Selectable, so that when Selectable disable we are not moving this Blueprint anymore anywhere. So uncheck this Selectable. If you found this video useful, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons below.